Hi guys, it's Sam, and I'm here with another Imperfect Foods uh, food haul. And they used to be called Imperfect Produce. Now they're called Imperfect Foods, which is because they expanded to just more than produce. And if you're not familiar with Imperfect Foods, sorry, I feel like I'm really too close. Let me just back a little bit. So if you've never heard of Imperfect Foods, they are an online grocery store. I've used them for several months now and I really like them. I feel like their delivery fee is really reasonable and I get it almost every week. Now, I can't solely use this because they don't have everything I need, but it does tie me over and sometimes I can um, just use this, but it's not like a shop ride or um, a stop and shop, those kinds of stores, they don't have everything, but they do have a lot of stuff. And I wanted to share another haul with you. Uh, I just got it today. My delivery comes every Thursday. And yeah, so let's get started. The first things are these persimmons. I got three of them and they look like this. My sister really likes them. So hopefully they're good. I haven't had the best luck with fruit in ordering from this company, but the veggies have been pretty good. Oh, so fruit and lettuce aren't that great. Um, but I feel like lettuce just doesn't travel well. So I don't know. Uh, next are these ginormous carrots. I got, I think it's two pounds, huge. Then here are cucumbers. I have four of them. And this one, it's like, I have to use it up soon. Uh, so that's what the imperfect, that's where the imperfect comes in. So there would be like dips and scratches and things like that. Um, only one time I felt like apples that I ordered. So the fruit being bad, they were like, some of them were brown already and past the point of eating. Uh, so I don't, I just don't order apples. And then here's cabbage. And a lot of times the items tend to be on the smaller side, um, compared to my head. That's a, I guess, a medium-sized one. Sometimes they're larger. Then here is a spaghetti squash. I was thinking of making, um, I saw this recipe for spaghetti squash pizza boat. So you just put some, I think it's some type of cheese and pepperoni in there. So I think I might do that. Also three avocados which would be perfect for taco night that's coming up. This very tiny bit of kale. I thought this would have been enough because last time I ordered it, it was huge, but this one is very small. And I don't know if I can make two cups out of this. We'll see. It might just work out. And then here is a cauliflower. I just made tonight cauliflower buffalo bites, which are so good. If you haven't tried those, I would highly recommend. And then here are Lakeside Snacking Collection tomatoes, different colored tomatoes, cute. And then the last thing that I ordered were these eggs. And they always come um, in like a dry ice bag and I haven't had one cracked egg yet, knock on wood. This chair is wood, so knock on wood. And do you know that the last time I ordered eggs, I don't know if it was my mistake and I just kept on clicking add eggs or it was like a weird internet, I don't know, snafu. I received, so I opened the box and I'm like, oh, here's one. I had ordered two uh, cartons of eggs. So I pull out one, two, and then I'm like three, four, five. I was just like, what is this? This is crazy. And the company right away refunded me for the three cartons. I was like, can I donate it to somebody like a program maybe you guys do like where for needy families or something like that where I could donate the eggs and they're like legally they can't do that. But they did refund me and I gave away two cartons of eggs. And this happened to coincide with Christmas Christmas, Christmas Eve, New Year's. So we used up the eggs right away. That was not a problem, the ones that I had, but five would have been just too many. Um, but yeah, I really like this company. I've used it for several months. I highly recommend. And if you have tried this uh, online 
the company let me know if you use another one i know there's one out there called misfits and um yeah i hope you guys are all doing well happy new year this is the first video i'm probably going to put up for the new year and i tried filming on my new camera and like a dummy i didn't check to see if i had enough battery in here but just so you guys can see what it looks like close up love it so excited this mic did not come with it my sister got that as part of um my christmas gift she got she got me a whole bunch of accessories like a tripod and just everything that i would need to get started um yeah so i will be filming on this camera soon just not for this video i'm still filming on my phone which is a good second um yeah so i'll talk to you guys later bye